Sentinels versus Envy to kick off our winner semis. And we're already having ourselves, at least Sentinels, trying to decipher where they even want to go early on. It's more of a default. Yeah, at least for the time being. Dude, I've been looking for a. Uh, not a team that's instantly going to rush into a side. They're just going to fill out the map. I've been looking for a, like, Marv PC. Before Solid about a position. In the meantime, we see a little like, bit of case, as weird as it is. Like a case within a case. Like, I want to have a cooled, a cooled case where my computers are in. I just don't know if that's possible. Like, build it. So you're kind of looking more for, like, building a housing. Up like a built in. Yeah, like a built in cabinet for your computers, essentially. Yeah. That's what I really, really. Really want. I just don't know the it's right yourself, way. Of, I don't know the right way of doing that. Like, is it just fans within fans? Like, is it fans inside a cabinet? Well, it would or? be your normal. Well, yeah. Right. That's what. Well, it would have some type of ventilation and then fans, right? I guess. Yeah. That's really, it's really that simple. Or you have the AC run to it, <laughs> like straight to it. You put the AC vent and you just fucking tube it through there, and you put the AC pumping in there. That would yeah, be fucking ideal. The danger, the danger of that is you got to have the right temp because you, you know, it might build moisture, and if it builds moisture, that's a problem. Is, yep, that is a problem. Uh, I, I'm sure you're. I mean, you can do anything. You just gotta get the right people behind it. But that would be so sick. I just don't like my computers. I, it's weird. Computers have gone through this phase where first they were just like this blocky thing, and that's it, right? And now they've gotten to the point where they're like high-tech RGB, but in my mind, they're losing that RGB, and people are trying to go more minimalistic now, and they're trying to hide them. And that's where I think, yeah. that's where I'm at. I'm at the point where I don't want my PCs to be in sight, at, out of sight, out of mind, just in their own little spot. You should get someone to install like wall mounts, but the wall mounts literally hide the PCs in the wall. That's, that's what I wanted to do. That would actually. be so cool, yeah. actually. I thought, Problem is, I thought that'd be. Cool I mean, I, like you press a button and they open type shit is what you're thinking. Like it opens the wall and allows you to touch the PCs and shit. Probably, yeah. Yeah, I mean that'd be really cool, but it'd be kind of annoying to like. Let's say you have to unplug a mouse and yeah. plug it back in or something. I mean, you got to build it with that functionality in mind from the beginning, right? So something you got to plan for. Yeah. Really, that same dialogue throughout this entire half. How is Sentinel going to be going up against that control of tempo from N? No. No. Wait. How does this happen? Plus, you got to have the space too. Thank you. Berkey. Oh, if it's in the wall, really. My Berkey's here. Thank you, Hannah, for the Berkey. Envy doesn't have a sage, by the way. <laughs> I'm just saying. Usually, usually no sage is an L. I mean, I'll tell you right now, Tens is on Reyna, so that's also an L. Yeah, he's on the gear. What would have been a really good nade. Wait. Okay, well, never mind. Send loses. <laughs> I do have Envy winning this in my predictions, so. It happens, I guess. Really? Yeah, I have Envy winning this. Okay. Okay. Let's see the rest of this take though. Sentinels, they're still playing around that mid side. They have control of orb and potentially control of A as there's only one person playing contact. Here's the thing though, it's the one with the nade and the other would have had double shock darts, but Crash doesn't have that repertoire. So Victor, you got all the YouTube. Oh, oh, timing is great. Timing. Timing. Oh, that was unnecessary, but whatever. He plant, he plant. Elevate position over towards Rafter, but as the poison runs out, he does have to back out. 
not exactly a safer position to be at but fns he ends oh up my god away. that timing Manazon as well makes his way through. Zom's currently on the you see that shit Zom's trying to play up on that first oh contact oh, yeah. know that there. oh man we still have to fight this Zom's coming up from behind it is counter eco is coming oh comes up has to get a right that's not up. gonna be able to get the kill but still delaying a little bit of time mind. crash is going for the defuse still a two on four and yes the right hey, never mind i'm wrong big advantage <laughs> very wrong expected from the very beginning not even close like sentinels they make it entertaining at least such an anticlimactic ending you were hoping that zombs is good for at least one there draw attention away allow the rest of his team to peek with those sheriffs but no zombs i'd say it's more or less unfortunate timing zombs joke that envy no, it dead. was he got spotted the starts but they do it's not a joke if you get spotted. A little bit easier losing only one player, that being Victor. So reinvestments are going to be pretty light here. On the other side, Sentinels dipping everything from their pockets into this round. Operator in hand for Shazam. The rest with the rifles. We'll see how this one pans out. This early on, poison up towards the mid side. It looks to be a more focused hit towards this B side, though. However, there is one person to contest. Again, that being marved over towards B main with the snake bites already used. <laughs> oh, Shazam! <laughs> Tide angle in mid, but it's Ye already ready for that trade. Sick has at least found a little bit of space. The Owl drone forcing Marv away. Now, how does Marv play this position? Again, we see the Nano Storm popped up alongside the Poison Orb just to delay. Both have been he missed the right click. Out. A right click isn't up to him I to just hide. So FNS is in a good <laughs> position to at least try and support. He doesn't even have a second Nano Storm. So no. A right click's decided by the game. Uh, it absolutely does. And essentially, what they're relying Boing. on is this Poison Orb mm -hmm. up on that front mm -hmm. side. They have a lot more liberty to plan, and indeed they're gonna take take that advantage. A snake bite plus the orb combo. Sick is able to escape. Yay with a spam through, but he's not able to find anything. That's gonna be a revive back and heal up back for sick. Out goes the retake in for Yay. Yay trying to find the begins, so that's not good. There's three in his stream, but he's still not able to find anything. Out goes the ball. And he's able to get two. And Vaness now the last man remaining with a guardian and a hope. But Sentinels, they tie up. That is not good for the opposition. Still missed from that close. What do you mean? He's not at the advantage. Bro, it's a fucking classic. You're not at the advantage when you're in someone's face. It's still a phantom versus a fucking classic. You realize that. You realize he only, he didn't choke that. He just got spotted. It's literally that simple. The lesser gun in this instant, he's going to opt for the sheriff. Operator bought up for EA, and he's one of those players that I, the desk was talking about. He can be so explosive, right? 20 kills against TSM on every single map. He Even if he didn't get player, spotted, it's still really hard to come out on top of the classic there Operator and save the fucking round. That is not his fault. Where is even gonna play I know you can't game. understand that because, you know, you know, you play at a lower level, but over towards a. it's just unfortunate. But it's the contacts that's... Oh, we're seeing mainly a lack of sentinels still maintaining themselves relatively spread apart. Envy, I do like this take back of B main though. They're so confident to take this control and the two players here because Ye is kind of just locking it down on top of screens towards that A side. Two swarms to support there as well. The focus pivots back towards mid and B. Yeah. For now, sentinels. Nothing but quiet here. That orb will slowly start to fade. Now, Victor's positioning. He's got the elevation. It's a high-low setup here from Envy that might honestly catch Sentinels off guard, but he does at least decide to reposition. Victor tossing blast. Yeah, Satchel was literally Alabama sideways. Works, actually, too. No. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, baby. Jesus. As a revive comes into play, it's FNS alone. multi everybody. FNS. He has the angle, but he's not able to get the shot. Ye's a little bit far away, but he just has to line up. Oh, he has to line up with Radiant Knight triple, but it's not going to happen. Wall goes up. Get absolutely roasted. Yeah, I hate it, man. People try to prove their fucking point, and they're just wrong. Doesn't have knives. Zom still has double snake bites, so time is going to be played heavily by Sentinels going forward. Yay. He has to contemplate picking up a rifle, and absolutely he will. He has no clue who these last two players are. Do you win this? Towards yellow, where they're cross firing. Early slow orb. Very well timed at that. Yay, still trying to look around um, for a maybe. main contact. Finally moving on to yellow, but well. sick. Just has the better nope. crosshair placement nope. and the better angle. He does not. It's be a three to two. The Sentinels do a really good job of just retaking that B main control. Understanding that the stack was there. They're able to funnel out Marv, play the trade game, play the double sling. And well, all this chaos erupting in towards B main. And Victor, unfortunately, running out of bullets and then getting late swung on by Zom. So, difficult round for Envy as it felt like they had full control with Ye on the opposite side. Four players very close in rotation to that B bomb side. But 
a little bit of an overstep, and Sentinel is already able to overpower them. So reset here on the NV side. They're going to be working with only the single Phantom. Sub count at Shroud. I don't know. So despite having the I have no idea. 10,000, 12,000, 13,000, 14. I don't know. 15. I, I literally don't know. Incredibly early peak. Ha <laughs> ha. That bullet looking like a magnet. Fuck. Sam, it's the first bullet that comes out mid jump, and he's able to get the kill. There, you do have a trade back from Marv though, with your rifle still in his hands. And Envy still holding out a three-man stack on A. Yeah, you gotta love that from Sentinel. Shazam making that a call to try and deny the Blades. Storm from Ye, and they do exactly that. Instantly updrafts up, takes that fight, and well, they do go one Just for one. waiting still, like, for him. Advantage. Heavily lies with Sentinels, but again, these ultimates can be the That's game changer. Me. Crash is able to are find one on the bottom towards sick, and now suddenly Envy have the man advantage, and things are looking dicey here. Nah, I'm legit just pissed for Shazam. He had the timing. He looks away for literally one second, and there goes the peak back. But in goes yet another. So kill. much fighting, dude. No kills. Yeah. Shazam Crazy. Up a kill onto Crash. This is not how I expected this match to go. This is like a a, a grind right now. 45 seconds left. And there wasn't Jesus. really any credible threat for this lockdown to even go down. Sentinels, yes, they are surrounding the A site, but Spike hasn't even made its way throughout site. And now we're seeing Sentinels go back. Yeah, with this lockdown left. faded, all goes up to the B site to try and sell the fake. Victor has not bit. He's only on 20 HP, but we know how good this man can be. There's a reason why they called him food. You gotta try and feed him here, but unfortunately, he's not gonna get much. Dapper on 12 HP. Marv, too far off, however, if he's able to find a pick here, he evens things up to a 2v2. It's the mileage. Marv has already gotten two off this here rifle. How many more can he get? FNS. Oh. No way! What the hell? The <laughs> Out goes the domain expansion in the mid side as the site's a little bit bigger. Marv has more space to stretch out in and potentially some more cheese. Out goes the rifle, sees the barrel. Songs is gonna go down. Dapper now in a 1v1. Only one HP left. What? Oh, from what? <laughs> no, no fucking way. Oh my god. No fucking way, dude. And it's still a W from NV and it's shambles. It's disastrous. That's unbelievable. What just That's wild. Dude, Dapper thought he had the height advantage. The Viper wow. blocks his line of sight. Oh, that no. is absolute trash. Look at he that. didn't see him, He's dude. He couldn't see him. him. Just above it. I don't believe it, oh, Dapper. No, the, the second That's right. right click. Even just a left click would have done it to the back. Oh, my. Oh. See, now that was a whip, right? I guess this is quite the way to keep this game That's tied filter. up, to keep this game even. We continue now, Sully, with the play over towards mid, and it's very organized. Oh my. Sentinel's trying to make oh my, oh my, oh my. Three four. players up, and it's three players down. Make it four. Shazam to the last turn remaining in a 1v5. He has 30 HP and knives. What a round already from NB as they stack everything over towards mid. An absolute slaughter. Everyone pivots back. Marv is ready to focus towards the under two position as Ye has gotten aggressive in the B main. <laughs> he's just hopping around. He doesn't miss those right clits. Maybe Dapper does, but he certainly doesn't. Four to three for Envy. And Sentinels, they put everything into that round. So here's the reset. Here is where they need to go on an economic reset and try and at least figure out what they want to do. We're seven rounds into this game, now moving into the eighth, and it hasn't been bad for either of these teams. It is as close as it can get. Sentinels will just have sheriffs to work with. Zom's mm -hmm. the only one going with an upgraded rifle, but Envy, plenty of credits built up, and again, two major ultimates, that being the showstopper and Ye's Bladestorm if they need to pull on that. Zom's actually upgrading to Guardian, which is only, it isn't exactly going to heavily if the internet problem is permanent, would you ever consider moving out? Up two players with an early no choke no point. problem is players permanent. Towards B main with a KJ this time playing up. Everything can be fixed. Gone aggressive, giving confidence to Envy that this should be a B. Hey, one person, I think Crashy is going to Al or at least spot mid as the rest of the. It's kind of why it's a problem, right? Problem because it's no way. to be fixed. Problems are meant to be fixed, right? Right, chat. Well, but yes, if you're talking about, you know, theoretically, to if the it was impossible, near from going down, fuck yeah. Ends up close and personal, ends up getting the kill onto Marv and Sentinels. They have a lot of leg room here on the A site, but they are getting pinched. Oh, out goes at least that rotation. That back food was great. That back line. Very good. The knives. The plant still hasn't gone down yet. The showstopper is probiotic ready. daily. He is finally here. There goes one. Activia. One Activia. Wow. Activa. Wow! This pickup was phenomenal. He's 
done and done. Wow. An hour to make, 10 minutes to eat. Get it done. Yeah, you but it was good. He did it against TSM, and he does it here against Sentinels. A fifth round and a huge flank coming out for him. Not entirely won by him as it felt like the site was I was talking to Hannah. On lockdown, but hey, I missed kind of a, everything that happened. You just, oh, my you God. Saw, yeah, no, you, the whole yeah, sequence there was sick. That being there, Eco, yeah, he's kind of nasty. Yep, this is the pickup, apparently. Mummy's crying. Mummy's crying. So some very valuable ultis period for Sentinels laying around for Envy. They have absolutely nothing. Sentinels, at least they have that pro going. Hell Diablo. That disadvantage. Yay, what? Is Yay's thing or what? Oh, two tags. Oh, yay. Diabolo? The cheese that he would have liked a little bit earlier on. That I. Getting right in the middle of his screen. Yay, fully flashed. He had yet another pretty good first contact position. Oh, I mean, swift I mean, with it. He He's fast. Sight, though, and he does Look at him. All that drone in, baby. Kill, to say the least, but still oh. Victor has all the info. Oh, Victor. All the Look info. Victor in mid. Still waiting up for the cross. Oh, God. Okay, but he didn't use the info to his uh, advantage. They can make this rotation That's back. like a let them all pass. They're all going A. Yep, get the team there first. The call. Shazam. Front with the oh, no. Shazam's doing Shazam things. He's gonna nail the shot. Four versus two. All right. <laughs> Cratchy's <laughs> running in. This round uh, got flipped on its head. Lights out so far. It's a little bit out of his pay grade to win this one. A four versus one in Sentinels to bring things to four. Oh, man. A first round in a good while without post-plant shenanigans, without any sort of drama whatsoever. An opportunity to breathe as, again, Envy. They, they keep trying different things. I can appreciate that. But potentially, it's it could be a hint of over-aggression. Yay. You can feel him, at least over towards B main. He's in a pretty good position to get a first contact. But that push up in mid that has already happened twice now, three times now in this half of loan, I feel as if Envy, they may be getting a little bit too overconfident. Maybe stunt that mentality a little bit. Yeah. Especially Victor in a position where it's so hard to get out. Even if he's able to get a kill, he's very easily tradable. Yes, he's got the blast back to get out, but even then it's so simple to chase down a, a raise trying to get away and will Envy. Victor gets punished, the A site was completely open, and... A shot from Jazam here, but overall Sentinels to punish yeah. Envy and make rounds again. None of these rounds have been free for out of these teams, so you see kind of the economic impact that it's had on Envy. <laughs> a couple of players here Looks like team not doing so good for credits as FNS on well, hazmat suits. Yeah. Zero, unfortunately. Look at the short one. So economically, on the... Envy haven't been. Oh yeah, what the heck? That's Sentinels a... that one's short. It's for penguins. Not necessarily to reset them. Lol. He's put a huge dent in that economic situation. Yeah, Sentinels. They still have two rounds in terms of flexibility with their economy. So, absolutely, it's it's actually Envy's time to at least go through the ringer. And in terms of changes, I'm actually very happy to report that we are seeing most of their players really backing out. Ye has a very good angle, though, on top of yellow. It is very big contact, but Sentinels, they are thinking about this B area. Out goes an L drone that could be able to catch his Ye's cheeky position, but it's not going to catch anything. Everyone else from Sentinels heading towards B. Yeah, late L drone goes down. Big round here, Ye. Good luck. From Crashy, so he's kind of concerned that the full focus comes from B main. And well, Ye. Oh, 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 oh. He got freaking saved, dude. And he got out as yet. well. FNS gets that crazy wow. gets up and they can push everyone out of the site with help from finesse left. I mean and great help actually in this rotation two oh, players still no. ready for a but even then one's going to be locked down and there's nothing you can really he's do he's baiting the detain hoping they make the some uh kind of just sitting in b main it's a it's a waiting game there, they ain't on. calling for it no -uh. yep this one he can just maintain this cross, and indeed, he's going to keep it. He's going to be able to get one big one. And Surprised he didn't know that someone was there, there at all. with the bait. Possibly, just yeah. Long-term storytelling at this Definitely point. Possibility. He was there at yellow. He was detained for a while. There was a reason why, because they had the angle on cross. Oh, this is impossible. Not a bad idea entirely, but just about 10 seconds left. They're desperate to put down this fight. Oh, FNS I thought wow. for a second it was possible. Back, and Victor's still able to get another one. And TNT. Yes, they hold down the site, but... Sentinels, they at least have the right idea. It's it's such a threatening presence when you have an operator on the map and it's in the hands of Ye, right? He could be anywhere. <laughs> on A, on B, he finds the same impact. And there on B, 
you 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 don't clear with an Aljorn, you do clear with an Aljorn, and then he takes that repeat. He's willing to take that fight on top of yellow, find that first pick as he drops down, and well, Envy finding six to four. They're gonna reposition the operator once more and send to the. What happens if you put a wall on a to try and avoid that on a nade like that? Does it go away or does it go on top of the wall? Because it lifts from the ground, you know. You're asking the wrong guy. It probably lifts up, I would assume. At the same time, Victor Physics. and Ye will work toward the A side. That's just how Jet Ops works, Ellie, especially the most proficient in the industry. Very flexible, flying all over the map. And when I mean flying, I mean legitimately flying. Ye going in, soaring through the A site. He's not able to get anything, though. Has to still watch out those back lines. Damn, double bouncer right there. That's a dart. Around. A for Sentinels and, uh, well, That's a dart. A decent attempt for You're right. Yay, but for now, they're not able to get any picks. All gonna fall into FNS here. Reposition back towards the mid side. And he gets two. FNS got that grip though. He might FNS get three. Is that first contact? Oh wait, Actually, they're all going. Two players in the kitchen side. Oh my god! But he's been denied. Quick peeked his ass. But Tens is like, dude, if I didn't have 50 ping, I would have headshot him. <laughs> Definitely. Yep. Definitely about the ping. And buying all this time, how do they try and save this off? Okay, dude. Let's get zero. While they're fighting back. Not only the util, but they're also spamming through. Sick, able to get a big one right through. Oh, yay is a big opportunity. Yay oh, on the that's flank. Spotted, they have no ideas in this corner, wow. but finally they peek him out. Oh, oh, to oh two hell. If he right clicked him there, that's a dub. Damn, close match though, for real. Yeah. He's looking out for the players in B main. And Sentinels potentially think of their lucky stars that, that flanked him. Wow, house. yeah, he gets spotted at the very last second from Sick. And wow, I don't know how in the world Shazam is alive in that situation, taking a full right click to the body. I think only two knives landed for that 100 HP. So Envy, last round of this half. It's not the best of buys to end on either. Sentinels, there was that economic drought that they were hoping they could capitalize on from the Envy side. And they do exactly that. Sheriff present for Victor. The rest of Sentinels, they've got their full buy. So shaky for many of you to close it out. But Sentinels, they're going to take things slow towards the A side. Four players immediately pushing up. Never mind. They're taking it quick. They're taking it fast. It's Victor alone. Only a Sheriff in hand. And the only quick rotation is Crash Cheese. Oh. Looking to punish, but the shot doesn't connect. And rotations are being pushed through B main from the enemy side. Yeah, Victor dangerously low on HP and is still sticking around the back of sight. Shazam, actually, another cheeky angle, and he's able to get another kill. And Envy, they're only they're already broken down to three players off this very last round, and it's two people being spotted out at the same exact time. Shazam with a double kill. I mean, I gotta oh be honest. God. I gotta be honest. I was about to comment on this. I gotta be honest. Ye is just real, real wide dominating on his opening performance. Like seriously, he's not losing a lot of fights in general. That he could possibly want. Like, <laughs> dude, he is owning, man. Yeah, yeah he is. Oh my and god. He's in his fucking element right now. Very, very interesting. Interesting characters. Story. Good. Yeah, three players at least posted up. An early Boomba already presented here by Victor Turt to go as well. It's just like, it's gameplay mechanics are kind of lacking. And other mechanics are missing. Contact at the very end. They slip back in the A side. I don't know if this is going to work. I don't like this classic skin. It's kind of clean. The KO. It's the one from uh, KO. Finishing KO's like leveling or whatever. Mm. So, a little bit of a grind. With the sheriff is good to find the first like he did in the first half. Still gonna be two more bodies for him to aim at. Oh my god. Combo. And and Shazam oh, yikes. Crashy's trying to run for the hills. And in comes from behind Dapper this time trying to help. Wow. All right. Um, Envy going home. Grouping up on the A site. It's a flawless start. <laughs> right. That was the concern. It's like, well, the fake didn't really work out. And still, Tens and Shazam. Let's get this show on the road. <laughs> <laughs> Got places to be. The heat for tens. He was able to swing off of that ghost, and well, rotations are so so quick with Dapper towards that mid side. Seven to six Sentinels. New World will be coming out in three weeks, but it's not. What's the buy looking like? Almost two months. Ghost Protectors bought up Phantom for Dapper, and Shazam is gonna hold that Sheriff. Why? Yeah. Because he's looking to get that Operator ASAP. I want to grind. Drop some trees down. Mine some ore. Mine some fucking ore. Cook some chicken. I mean, it kind of makes sense. He's playing front makes line. Makes Front post, so anything having a specter rather than pistol. What? So they don't get ecoed. Uh, I'm sorry. Did you, did you just see how he got that kill? No, I was looking at my phone for a second. <laughs> what the fuck? 
That was probably the fastest classic kill I've seen. Look at the range of Boiler to where that tube is. He killed him so fast. Who died? Dapper? I really want to see a replay of that. That was fucking crazy. Oh, that was clutch. Oh my god. The movement. He's looking at him. He's in his element right now. Yep. He died, but it was cool. Dude, Dapper had to have gotten hit by two players. There's no way that was one person's classic. It's just not possible. We, we got to move on to an actual buy round from NV though, because again, we're not seeing uh, anything, anything. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, that was like as close as it fucking gets right there. I don't know where he wants. He, he could be anywhere. Tens. I don't know. Great work there in the middle of the A bombs. I, like you said, we just had to wait for the real gun round, which it comes now. Full buyback for Senzo with those two specters and that one phantom being only been saved. Envy Ooh, I like this aggressive fight mid with tens. There is a change of pace. Ooh, there goes the orb. And out goes the Eldron at the same time. Where's the spam now? Where's the follow up? The Eldron's not able to get any sort of ping. Classic so only radiant? Oh my god, that'd be kind of sick. Otherwise, the rest Challenging, but that'd be sick. I feel like you'd get reported for throwing, though. You know what I mean? Probably get banned. The combo isn't there presently for the Nano Storm and Viper. So dumb. That gun pisses me off watching it every time. Yeah. It's very much like the 1.6 fucking MP5, I swear. Or a Mac 10 in CSGO. Because, like, that's what you do with a Mac 10. You just sprint and hold mouse one. You don't ever stop. It's just, I don't know. It's just dumb that players have gotten to the point where it's almost abusing it while moving. You know, like, they'd rather move while using yeah. it than actually aim with it. You know, that's what bothers me. Yeah. It's not the intention of the weapon. Still the rest of Sentinels sitting around this site, waiting for that approach. 25 seconds left. They can't abandon now. If he goes into the middle of sight, only going to be able to get one. And make there it we go. Yay. There we again. go. Well, how many kills do you have? I feel like he's been popping off. Maybe he hasn't. 17, I'm guessing. 16, no, 14. I feel like he's been doing better than that. Late, late lurk. Causing a lot of confusion for the side of Sentinels and well, while there were two players who saw the idea, at least from Dapper, to try and support his team out of the left side of Raptors that tends to get away, but players coming in from all directions, it's so difficult to hold that line of sides. And well, Sentinels, it's not going to be a full bonus that they were hoping for, so now they've got to work with just Sheriffs and well, Envy, they know they're on an eco round, they're going to full send into the B side, it looks like. Yeah. Well, let's see it then. This is our first real rush if we do get one them. from Envy. All four players lined up trying to barrel their way through. Speaking of barreling, it's actually the barrel of Sentinels players. Four of them still already going back. <laughs> They're ready for this. Yes. Dude, he okay, dashed he's through. Gone, but it's a range for yes. Dude. Is he going to be the double dash? Dude. Yes. Yes. What the heck? Wait there. Go what back. the heck? Who is this guy? Oh my god. He dinked him through the, the pole. Holy. His confidence is so high right now. Holy. Oh, oh. Uh, I, that's what he's there to do. He's he's literally jet one trick. That's what he's there to do. So it's good to see that he's doing it. Dare to do it. <laughs> not good. Good like um like kind of mental to not drop into a panic spray there. He kind of kept his burst. He would have whiffed if he if he dropped into a spray. Going for the fucking very very steady. He's got lots of lots of power in his brain. Looks easier than it actually is to just like not let it rip. Beyblade. Let it rip. And then he whips that. Oh, that sucks. He should have just left clicked. It looked like he was hanging for a second. Trying to figure out if he should left or right. They haven't broken it down. Nobody is in shorts. There's still players for envy trying to fight this out. As Shazam posted up on the They're stuck though. 
goes down to FNS from blows. Below. I said that the mid lurk I should come know in. somebody's flanking. They just gotta take fights or let the team heaven. fuck up. He's making a whole lot of noise. Yeah, it that's quite obvious that he's there and Zapper finds him. Tans has the cross in a tight angle in the back that of the sucks. Ball. And he goes oh in for goodness. a wide swing, running and shooting with the vandal because there's that's just what he does. A nine to eight score. It, it's a head to head. Ten says what you can do, yay, I can do better. It's not an ace, <laughs> but it's a four K and a full buy round. That's, like he if, he didn't even yeah, I don't know. It looked like he was trying to like he was thinking about which one to do and then he got trying to get closer and right click. I don't know. Maybe he was calming during that? I don't fucking know. Something something happened. <laughs> There was an error. It's the head to head, folks. 19 kills, and that 4K was purely just to push him above that. That is just petty. <laughs> it is <laughs> pettiness oh, from Ted. No. But oh my word, Shazam. He is delivering that exact Jesus. same message from his teammate. A massive shot from the middle of the air. He's now Sentinels. Already sitting around with a bit of an Like if they had a Sage, he could have a res right now. Contact. Maybe. <laughs> just tens here, and he's got the ability for the kill to dismiss. I mean, he can fade away. They're actually ulting this. Lockdown goes to me. I feel like this is a lost round. Stand, but no one on envy. I mean, this spot too for the old confidence of tens is hilarious. It's actually so funny to watch that. No. Oh, that was a bad time to pull your wall out. Oh, no, they're throwing. Get blocked and fucking wall out. Try to place down wall wow. Yeah, they, that's a throw. Actually, okay. You really have the worst predictions on Twitch. <laughs> and I mean that in the nicest way possible. First of all, on the verge of a reset. Yeah, it's been like that for years. <laughs> I used to predict when I was on C9 and CS matches and... My team just stopped listening to me at one point. <laughs> they just didn't care anymore. Like, what the fuck is this guy? Yeah, I don't. I don't think I was ever right with a single prediction ever. They just don't even ask you anymore. Be there as well. I think that's what Sentinels read into and put Tens in a difficult position where he's got to hold it down. And yes, he's good, but even then, it's envy. It's difficult. Yeah. Okay, oh no. It's up top. No chance in that position. But nine to nine. No operator safe for Sentinels. And like you said earlier. They were on the verge of a reset, but I think Sentinels, with the ultimates they have specifically, that being the Bladestorm, I think they should be able to muster a decent buy against Envy. Yeah, yeah could still get up a buy from Shazam. Kind of redistribute yeah. that cash, which is exactly what he's doing. Yeah, 3.9, almost 4.5k. He's still able to spread I feel like if you're a betting man, you just bet the on the opposite of me always. Sentinels, Bladestorm, of course, in the hands of Shazam. Now the rest of NBA, what did you say? You said if you're a betting man, you bet on my opposite Yay, like prediction. Opposite you always staff. bet the opposite. That makes sense. And you'll win. You'll win big. Stinger. Definite risk that they cross over towards there. There's the swing. Yay, not ready. Up close, the Stinger definitely is going to It's a good thing we're getting a great POV of all of that. That was awesome. I really, really saw that that unfold. Great trades. <laughs> Fake towards this B side, just defaulted yep. out, feel out the pressure on the map, and well, it kind of falls flat on its face. The 4v3, Shazam still with those nines, and there's one player here that he's got a chance to win against, and Shazam doubling down on these frags, four versus two, and well, they've only needed to extend just this one. These last two players of Crashes and Marg are sucked towards B main, and while Shazam is looking to challenge, it's a difficult runaway here for the enemy side. Ooh. Ooh. Uh... A very quick one tap, and he's able to take it back. Same thing with Shazam over towards spawn. And yeah, no, there you go. Sentinels, not exactly uh, too, too much drama, but it's really the first round that they were proactive and even trying to chase out those early frags. These games make me want to play ranked until I fucking play ranked. Yeah. Like you said, to chase out those frags on both sides. Then we get caught in that default. Not the same. Not the same. Working their magic. But whatever tournament mode that's leaked could be pretty pog you champion. Not the best of buys. I think the main salvation is that while they don't have the blade storm, they're gonna have the showstopper for Victor. So even though he doesn't have necessarily a rifle, he's got, you know he's got a rocket launcher. So it's basically, if anything, it's a little bit better. Shazam, Damn. towards the top rope. Is I like that. Victor, remove him from the field of play, and now things get a whole lot harder. Now you don't have that entry. Oh now my God, bro! They already got two freaking picks, man. Out. You don't need to go for a third. Holy! Sentinels, they do feel a little bit of that pressure. I swear, if they so lose to that shit. Bar, but Dapper <laughs> needs to maintain the spray there. If Finesse takes him down, 
Oh god. Oh, a little too much for us. He didn't even fucking go with bullets. <laughs> he literally showed up with like four bullets. They're gonna get spammed because they're so low. Like they're, they're gonna find a stray somewhere. I like this by finesse actually. Oh. Oh. She's had the edge. The spray done. Six literally jumping through. Jumping out. The rest, the rest. 2v2. Dangerously low HP for everyone. Revive that revive at the same time. This is crazy. And he goes for the revive. Oh. I'm so nervous for finesse. Oh. Through and he's not able to get the kill, but it's still a lot of They're bo- Ah, oh, they're so low. Shot through, but the barrel was Oh. Shazam still gets the kill. Marv's in a 1v2. Spray. Run, run, Marv, run. He's actually off the spike. Still no, bro, no! You gotta run. You gotta, run. You gotta fucking evade. And even then, it's going to be a W. Oh my god. Levels. That was such a tense round. Close. Very close. You know what's crazy is this map could go either way. Like, it, it, this whole time, it could have gone either way. Yeah. That's what evens the odds out. Light risk pit to take this was Sentinel's pick, and they're bringing him to the brink here. Advantages lied with Envy, and Marv so close. One HP is all that Shazam had to think about that. That's an instant carve if you ask me. Sick makes that That's a tilt there. Now they're by. They just gotta save. Uh, Let mean, them have the match that, point. That, that could be the uh, thing of instant karma. In theory. Folks, at least going up into this next round, the economy was looking actually relatively decent for envy and it's still more question marks after the buy phase is over they get most of their buy uh, buys done by the very end of it they're left with two rifles and two sheriffs and a marshal it's a petri dish of buys it just still has that sheriff's on what the, the where did he find that oh my god he fought mess. mid and killed the guy boiler finesse you don't know that oh wait they bought wait no they yeah they, they bought out? they bought Sick isn't too far off, but he is Oh, dinked him, dude. Oh, oh, no. Oh. Okay, wait. Trades. Dude, this is just so ridiculous. This is just so ridiculous. Finesse, relax. Finesse, relax. It's at the exact same time as Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is such a close game. Holy. Oh my wow. god. Lead by example, Shazam. Two back to back 1v1 clutches. This one is a 1v2, but hey, Shazam gets it done. <laughs> wow. To push Sentinel to 12 with two crazy flicks on a Red Bull clutch. Envy, that was their round. Jeez, they had uh, in the 2v2. They had a 2v1, but Shazam, he is Man, so Finesse is fucking playing frisky nowadays. <laughs> yeah. He's not playing by the book at all. <laughs> Uh, Such an aggressive play for Shazam, but it catches everyone. The remaining two of FNS and Marved off guard. And that last buy from Envy doesn't exactly leave them in a position worse for rare. They're actually just fine. Just about 5k of most of their players moving forward. And it's a timeout, Sully. The first time in this game. And it might just Damn, be last. that's tough. The they, so they half game. bought. No, I don't want to say because that. they have full buys the now. Area, at least huh. the side of Envy. Really it close, is man. One, but it's that sucks. These last two rounds really just could have went either way. And if they did, we'd have a fucking tied up match here. Or Envy would be in the lead. Still, I mean, it, regardless, it was a very close match. Yeah. Like, if they win 13-9, I feel like it, it was like 14-12 overtime. That's what it felt like, you know? So envy, that's the big concern. They've got credits to buy. That doesn't mean that this is a surefire round with that lockdown. It all depends where it ends up going down. That right. the Viper's pit, at least. Uh, if we end up getting it early on over towards. I saw Kray's uses all. At least the lockdown. <gasps> utilized early Victor uses all. <laughs> As you got clapped by tens. Quick take could actually be worth it. But again, lots of options for both Envy and Sentinels at this point. That Came down to so many little things there. That dink instead of a, like he just hit him through the corner of the wall. Sully. Or maybe he didn't. Maybe that, the same shit that happened to me happened to him. Towards this A side where we see Marv. So we're lurking it up towards that B side. Now what does Envy do? They have a lockdown, so they could have A for free. Slow, clear, but with this yep. That's but sick is... Oh, never mind. They know he's there. Oh, they walled it, but that doesn't matter. Holy fuck! Fucking deleted his ass. Yeah, that's a deep lockdown. They gotta chill. Yeah, it was a free mitigate, plant. Oh my god, look at where Viper is right now. Look at where Marv is. 
Marvin's playing the long. Yep. He might catch they one here. Delay. They'll delay. Yeah, delay. yeah, he'll catch one. He'll catch one. Oh, nice. Food. Nice. He oh, caught he's... one. Oh, the trade. Tenth round. Tenth round. Uh, I got it. Grab that op. Save the op. Maybe. I don't know how much money they have. Suddenly, in a 1v3, in that late lurk for Marv... You can't lose guns here, though, if crashes. You need to... Now, this is about Unless they know that their money's low. Uh-oh. Because I think this would be Envy have no money. No, the economy of Envy is not going to be in a good spot right now, but hey... With these players not What's happening in this match? Let's see that money. Allowing a tenth to Dude, Hunter Thieves getting owned by XA right now. <laughs> All it starts with is that one single kill into tens. He falls, there's no Unfortunate. one else on sight. Yeah. The rest of Envy... Alright, first map. First half. Moving forward, this is actually Envy's golden ticket, Sully, to make their way yeah, back. They into got this three game. ults, so dangerous. Marvin needs to get a kill and get his ult. Half, essentially, with an opportunity to get reset. Well, their money. Wow, I didn't realize it's that low, but it makes sense because this has been such a close game. Still holding on to that yeah. For Zoms with the Spectre. So don't put too much weight in the round, but it's still very much important. Yeah, and I was going to say, you look at the ultimates that goo. they have, it's still a Green very Chaz does have an op, though. They lack. So, and knives. Zoms is going to be using the Spectre. Shazam. It's a ridiculous ult. They have a Blade Storm, so... Yeah. Let's see how this I don't think that's how it's supposed to work, but whatever. Bomb site. Oh, God. Chaz is about to win the game for them. Starting with... Never mind. Nope. He didn't clear it. Well, that's probably the round. Never mind, GG. Wow. Definitely with the knives, but tens. He's gonna be good on his word to find one in that chair. Right here. Four versus four, but one with six HP. Oh, this is a viper wall to lead into the back of sight. This is the first time we're seeing this finally. Potentially that wall is insane. Yeah, that's really Holy good. Fuck. A lot more control selling. I feel like that's almost better than the other wall. <laughs> what the hell? Well, it's just because you can't get it. Uh-oh. Tens is waking up. He I mean, he's been he awake. He's been awake. Oh, oh no. Tens just knows. One versus three now, and somehow he's the difference maker. No way Tens just wins this round. He's around yellow box. He might have this ace. Yes, he does. No, Victor, there is a Oh, my God. Let's go. Oh, my God. Oh. What a game right now. Oh my God. Dude, he almost killed himself with that fucking Molly too. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. That's so massive. I was so sure Tens would have had this ace, but Victor. Oh my god. Alright. We were saying that these are two teams, two titans. We've got three. Oh, this is big. Sick You've got well. fucking Marv's ult. They need to take A somehow. It's a whole show that these two teams yeah, are putting on. And this is only Icebox, dude. Envy, they haven't even played Icebox all that much. They only played like two maps of Icebox in the last few months. Sentinels, this is one of their best maps. If this is the type of map we're seeing out of Icebox, imagine the rest of this set. Folks, we got Look at Yeah, you go. I know. Look, he's at, so him. Look at him. He's, he's just alone. Uh, like, it's just. I mean, I don't agree with it, but they got to do something off A here. Like, fast. Fast. That, now they already know. I mean, that might have been the game right there. Yeah. Like, think think if Ye got, gets the kill, then Envy yeah, wins. But. Oh, yeah. Tens is about to get a 3k. He has his ult right here, too. This is, a, this is over. It's over. It's over. No. What a weird little gimmick to kind of try to tie up the game. But I guess they're trying to change it up. Might be lining up that Viper's pit, but again, oh, I dinked him. That's time, unfortunate. And it's just awareness, isn't it? Sick with a peak GG. Oh. That's really anticlimactic. Yeah. They put all that pressure on that on on Ye and like the 